Hello and welcome to the Zignali Duna Park. My name is Derek Ray. With me in the commentary position is the Arsenal legend Lee Dixon. And the focus is on the Bundesliga. Live action coming up. It is Borussia Dortmund up against Stuttgart. Hi, Derek. Thank you. Well, both managers will be reminding their players how important it is to start off the game really quickly. Really attack the opposition, put them on the back foot, see what comes of that. Hopefully we get a good game. And so the battle commences. Here's the starting 11 for Borussia Dortmund. Roman Burki gets the nod and go. Rafael Guerrero starts with Thomas Meunier as fullbacks. Axel Witzel starts alongside Mahmoud Dahoud in the centre of the pitch. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. But a key factor for Dortmund this season has been their defending. In fact, nobody has done it better late. Well, with a defence like this, Derek, you have a real chance to win any game. The opposition know that too, so when they get a chance, they better take it, as the scraps will be few and far between. Well, that ball looks promising. Hazard. Well, he has players waiting at the back post. Not to be this time. Zitavi. Disappointing pass. He has time to play it over. Pulls it back. You'll be hard pressed to see many better saves than that. Roman Burki. And he's fired over the corner. Well, that is a moment I'm sure he wishes he could have back. Well, he did everything right, the movement and everything. He got his head on it, but it's way, way off target. Getting in there to intercept. Zitavi. Opportunity here. And he clears it out of harm's way. And now the delivery. So it's going to be a goal kick here. Wasteful in possession, Rice. Mongala. Zitavi. Doing well to keep possession. Sasha Kalajic. Derek, the visitors dominating possession. It's been really impressive. If they keep this pressure on, you feel a goal will come. Keep calm, no panic. Just a little bit more quality in front of the goal. And given away. He must finish. He's unable to take the chance, and he'll be disappointed here. Well, nil-nil. It should be one-nil. It really should. Marco Reis. Theme emerging of wasted possession. Wataru Endo. And an effective clearance. Marco Reis. Holland. And this is Reis. He's in with a chance. Can they stop it going in? Well, able to survive that attacking push. Now, potential danger. He's in position. And it's come off the keeper. Endo. And Sosa here. Mark Oliver Kempf. Valdemar Anton. Bonna Sosa. Oh, he's given it away.
And room now out on the wing. Oh, in with a chance. And struggling to get the shot off. Teammate in support. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. And there goes the half-time whistle. Borussia Dortmund find themselves on level terms at the interval. Everything to play for. In the... Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Valdemar Anton. Bonna Sosa. Well, the pass not finding its target. Erling Haaland. Zitavi. And given away by Dortmund. Endo. Castro. Now, what can they do from here? Still passing it around with authority. Castro. And Dortmund regaining possession. And a wild, wild attempt from long range. Not one for his highlight reel. Well, it's a poor choice. He's got other options on. Why is he shooting from that distance? So making the substitution now. And 30 minutes left for play in this match. Struggling to keep the ball. Kalajic. It might be on for them. Castro. Must take the lead here. Excellent defending. And breaking at pace with Menace. End product or not. And he might be through here. It was so near. Well, that's counter-attacking football at its best. Just needed to finish to cap it off. Read it superbly to take back possession. Castro. Intercepting it intelligently. Hummers. Well, Borussia Dortmund unable to retain possession. A good and fair challenge. Titavi! A goal it is at long last. They've broken the deadlock. Well, it's been so close this game. Tactics have played a part. Now they're going to have to change the tactics and see what happens. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? 15 minutes remaining. Mongala. Castro. It's with Daniel Didavi. An attack full of promise. And a little too close to the keeper in the end. There's a slide rule pass. And a goal to delight the fans. Just what they were hoping for. Well, here it is again. And all the credit goes to the goal scorer. But you have to ask questions about the keeper. He's got to have that covered for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. Well, a second goal for them here. Sancho could reduce the deficit and the keeper did more than enough well he's given a corner the referee over it comes 
And the corner far too close to the goalkeeper. Well, the ball lost here. Moving forward effectively. It looks promising. Now Witzel. They've got themselves back into it. A lifeline in this game. And this could be a dramatic finale. Well, here is the replay. It's a good goal, isn't it? It gives them a glimmer of hope. But you have to say, they haven't been good enough today. I think it's too little too late, Derek. Well, let's have another view of that goal. And there goes the final whistle. And I'll tell you what, that didn't go to plan for Borussia Dortmund at all in terms of the result, Lee. Well, Derek, the 2-1 scoreline suggests it was a really tight game. And this defence is normally very mean, but it could have been worse, to be honest with you. There's some work to be done on the training ground this week.